Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to get the current date and time in Android Studio with Jetpack Compose. Let's create the new Jetpack Compose project, select Empty Compose Activity, next, next to rename the app, get date and finish. We have an initial project, let's split it to see a preview, build and refresh, and inside on create method we see greeting function, let's rename it, refactor, rename, it will be for example get date and time function. Ok, let's rename the name, refactor, rename, it will be date and let's get the date inside our get date and time function. This create calendar variable is equals calendar dot get instance Let's try to display the calendar on the preview screen. For this in text field, let's add our variable calendar. Refresh, and we have many different code. Let's fix it. Calendar have a calendar type, and we need date type. For this, write dot and time. We have a date format. Let's build once more, and we have our calendar date and time. How can we get the date and time? separately from here. Let's format our date, create date format variable is equals date format and get date instance. Let's try to display date format instead of calendar, rebuild the preview. We don't have data here because we haven't added the calendar. Let's fix it, dot format and calendar. Let's try once more, build and we have our Date. How to edit the format of the date in get date instance? Write date format and choose, for example, full date. Rebuild and we see the full date without time. Let's add the time for this copy date format row and instead date write time format and instead get date instance write get time instance. We can delete it or we can choose display option, for example, shot. And let's create another text view for our time. Let's display time format, ok. Build the project. We have our time, but we need to place the date and time under each other. For this, create column and inside this column transfer our text view. Let's rebuild. It's good. Let's run the application and we have got the date and time in Jetpack Compose. We can remove the unnecessary parameter because we are not passing anything to the function. We will also remove the parameter from the preview so that there are no errors. Good job! I hope this video was helpful for you. Thanks for the watching. Like, subscribe. Have a nice day. Have a good coding. See you!